Hello, everyone. It's time for another pack with me vlog. We are off to explore Hong Kong and Macau for a week this time, and guess what? It's springtime. Join me in a capsule-style packing session as we prepare for this exciting adventure together. Let's pack with me. All right, let's kick things off with the basics: tops, bottoms, and outerwear. To start off, we have got a total of five tops, including four T-shirts and one long sleeve. So here's one of my favorite go-to T-shirts that I've worn countless times. It's super comfy, made from cotton fabric, which is incredibly breathable and perfect for any kind of weather. White is absolutely my favorite color, and whenever I travel, I will always make sure to pack at least one white T-shirt. Here's one from Uniqlo, my staple brand for basics. I decided to go for a size up because small size tends to be a bit snug around my armpits. Now let's talk about these two tees with similar designs. One white tee with straps and the other black with straps. Both were purchased during my last Melbourne trip from H&M. I'm a huge fan of straps tees because they maintain that minimalist vibe while adding a subtle visual flair to the classic white or black tee. What do you think? And finally, let's not forget this strap long sleeve shirt. Perfect for providing extra coverage for my arms. Especially since the weather forecast is predicting temperatures ranging from 17 to 20 degrees. What I love about this long sleeve is that it's not too body hugging, making it great for layering. Moving on from the tops, let's talk about these bottoms. I've got my trusty dark blue jeans and a pair of washout light blue ones. Having a pair of easy to wear jeans is an absolutely wardrobe essential. By easy, I mean it comes with an elastic waistband, making slipping into it a breeze. Crafted from stretchable fabric, it offers a comfortable fit. Originally designed as crop denim pants, it fits just right for me without needing any alterations, especially since I'm on a shorter side. Well, let's talk about the importance of having a lighter pair of denim pants in your wardrobe. It's incredibly versatile and can effortlessly complement a wide range of basic t-shirts, making it a timeless staple. I highly suggest adding one to your collection. Next, let's take a look at the outerwear including cardigans and jackets. For this trip, I've selected two cardigans, one in vibrant color palette and another in classic black. The colored cardigan features a mix of pink, purple and blue, adding a delightful pop of color to my basics. On the other hand, the black cardigan is crafted from lightweight cotton, making it perfect for layering. You can't beat the timeless appeal of a classic denim jacket. It's a must-have for spring, ideal for those chilly mornings or indoors. Nothing elevates my outfit like a cute beige short trench coat. It's my necessity for staying stylish while shielding myself from windy weather all without sacrificing comfort. Now let's transition to active wear. All I need is a sports shirt, a pair of yoga pants, a hat and a sunproof parka. Now that we have sorted through all the clothing, it's time to pack them up using these packing cubes. Remember to fold your t-shirts as minimally as possible to prevent wrinkles. Here's a handy tip, place the outfit for the last day at the bottom of the cube, then layer the outfit for the first day on the top. This makes it easy to access your clothes as you go. Packing cubes are a fantastic way to keep your clothes organized and easily accessible during your travels. Moving on to the toiletries and hair accessories. I always start by mentally going through my morning routine, remembering all the steps for my makeup and hairstyling to decide which items to pack. Then I lay them all out like this, slowly pack them into a clear pouch so that I can easily spot the makeup.
When it comes to facial products, I always try to get travel size bottles or samples if available as they are convenient for travelling. Don't forget to pack extra elastic bands just in case one breaks. They can be quite fragile. And colourful clips are a great choice to accessorise your outfit. Here's how I fit all these items into the luggage. Remember, it's essential to place the heaviest item towards the bottom half of the luggage. This way, when you lift it, the weight distribution keeps the center of gravity lower. And voila! The luggage is fully loaded and ready to go! The second to last category to pack is my gadgets. I usually fit all these items to my carry-on, my Kankan Samlaran 2C. First up, my most essential device, my laptop. Next, I will organize all cables, mouse and iPhone charges into this travel organizer. I keep my power bank and its cable separate for easy access, placing them at the side compartment. And of course, don't forget to bring along the international adapter. Bonus tip! I always bring my eye mask with me when I travel so that I can sleep peacefully in complete darkness on the plane. And finally, we have reached the last but certainly not the least category, Travel Essentials. This is absolutely crucial. I make sure to keep my passport in my crossbody bag, always close at hand. You can also slip in some candy for a sweet treat on the go. And of course, don't leave behind your wallet. It's also important to carry a pen along with you, just in case you need to fill up any immigration forms on the spot. These are all the items I'll be taking with me on this trip. Hope you had a great time packing with me. See you in Hong Kong.